Hey, hey everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. As always, it's Javi checking in. Happy Thursday, Little Friday, whatever you want to call it. We are back live here in Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. Hope everybody's week is going well. It is almost the weekend, so another chill live stream today. Uh, super excited to fly with you guys today, as always. Happy to be back in the sim. Still flying uh, World Update 11 Canada Edition this week. Uh, so leg two of three legs uh, in Canada this week. Uh, so it should be a nice scenic approach today uh, into... Oh, what's the airport name? Vancouver international oh hello truck <clears throat> oh, that's funny uh so yeah we are on the ramp here in edmonton uh this is a small regional uh airport in northwest edmonton uh which is i forget how to pronounce the um the actual name of it let me find it again. Um, but yeah, we are in Edmonton here on the ramp. Uh, let me let me see. Should be in here. Where is it? I did not load our flight plan in. Uh, let's do this real quick. CZVL. Bum, 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 bum. Villanueva? Is that how you pronounce it? So we're in Edmonton. <clears throat> we got a short runway today. So we'll be taking off uh, from Edmonton going down to uh, Vancouver, British Columbia. And we'll go over some sim update. Uh, world update 11 notes um, as we uh, head over there today um, I think there was a couple things in Ed downtown Edmonton there's a stadium and an arena that were updated in world update 11 for Canada edition but that is the plan today uh, we got flight time hour and 15 minutes 28 passengers 2100 pounds of cargo and luggage uh, I don't think we'll have any weather, so it should be it should be nice. <clears throat> uh, and yes, we are back in the PMDG, really, 737 BBJ, the 700 uh, variant. Um, and we will go over our, really, dude, our um, freeware for today. Uh, once we get up to cruise and all that good stuff. Um, so yeah, that is the plan. Thank you all for tuning in and hanging out with us today. Appreciate you guys uh, for watching and happy to have you for today's stream and chat. And if you're new or watching live, please say hello in chat. Uh, always love hearing from new folks. Um, and if you guys do enjoy today's stream and want to show your support to the channel, please hit the like and subscribe button. Would greatly appreciate it. It is a huge help to the channel. And always love to share my flight sim experience with you guys. Um, and I do live stream weekly and exclusively here on Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Sundays. So if you hit the notification bell, you will be notified for all of our future streams and uploads and won't miss a beat. Brownies, what's going on? Hey, hey, hey. Thanks for hopping in with us. Good to see you. Happy Thursday. Good to see you. Hope you are well. How is your Thursday going? Let's uh, bring this bad boy to life. Let's go battery on. We'll get the aft fuel pump on for the APU start. 
and APU is starting. Listen to her fire up. In between the fence here. Oops, wrong button. Let's reset our camera. <clears throat> Sweet, gens are ready. Let's get AP Gen 1 and 2 on. <clears throat> and we'll get AP Bleed flowing. Otherwise, I'll forget. Let's get our visors up, shall we? Boom. I'm going to hit B. Reset the altimeter 3038, cool beans. Uh, I just filed our flight plan. We'll be on the VATSIM network. Looks like there is some coverage at Vancouver International. So I think there's approach and tower on. But not sure if they'll be still be online by the time we get there. But we shall see. So we're going to squawk to Thou in the box for now. And we'll go 122.8 for Unicom until we have some coverage. Cool. Uh, let's go back up top. Let's get the packs flowing. What's the temperature here? Plus 15 Celsius. That's cool. <clears throat> let's get the both hydraulic pumps on. Logo wheel well lights can go on. Emergency exit lights. Boom. Seatbelts auto. The 10 button just because. And IRS is left and right, both aligning. Cool. Sweet. So I'm assuming we're the only bird here. <coughs> let's go down here. Let's get the... No, let's check our throttles. One, two. And oxygen. Cool beans. And let's call up the crew. Let's go fuel. Maintenance and potable water. We're going to need 11.5 on the gas today. <clears throat> Get that plugged in. Cool. So the crew should be rolling in here. Lab potable water guys doing tricks on the fence. That's amazing. Love it. comes the maintenance guy fuel it's getting hooked up here set up this camera for later cool so he should be about ready to start fueling and let's see yeah so for scenery today we will only have this airport where we're at now the Edmonton Villanueva uh, regional <clears throat> but we'll go over that um, at cruise today. Let's start fueling cool beans. And, yeah, I don't think anybody's on center or anything. No. Nope. So, yeah, we should be just on Unicom for the time being. Cool, let's go up here, let's get FPV on, traffic button on, data button on, right side, we go center button twice, traffic button once, and we'll come back down here, menu, FMC, set our position, Charlie ZVL, I think it was, yes, boom, let's go next page, copy our left GPS, paste it. 
Boom, there we go. Let's go route, paste our origin, and we're going to CYBR for Vancouver International. <clears throat> Let's go back to Sim Toolkit Pro, and we'll get this all filed and ready to rock. So let's go fly now. And MSFS connect. <clears throat> and now let's go back to Navigraph. Um, let's see. So the winds in Edmonton, Villanueva are 210 at 4. So. We're not going to be able to take off 1.6, that's too short. We're going to have to go runway 2.6. So let's do that. Let's get my Avia CTU going. Forgot to turn that on. Um, let's go depart arriving button, departing 2.6. There's no SID, just direct to today. And then arriving in. Vancouver winds are 290 at 10. So, let's see, where's the FBO? I have no idea. This looks like terminal. So, I'm going to assume, actually, let me see why VR FBO on Google. The old Googs. <coughs> looks like they have a signature and a millionaire. on the south end, so southwest. So this must be all the GA stuff. So signature, I think signature's right here on this corner. So we'll probably park on this ramp here. So, what were the winds again? No, not Adis, Utah. Winds are 290, so from the west. So yeah, 26 left. So we'll hit arriving, arrival. ILS 26 left via the Canuck 5 is our route. No transition. And let's go route. Next page. <coughs> and let's go to our, uh, let's get our direct twos in here. We're direct to Andy, whoops. And DIE, close you out the way. <coughs> so direct to Andy, then direct to NAD P, N A D P I, right? Yes, direct to, and then direct to Merit, M E. R Y T and then direct to booth. Wait, booth's already in there. That's our I think that's our uh, transition maybe. So we'll go activate execute legs page and let's check out our route real quick. So plan, zoom you out a little bit. So we are let's get the progress page on the right side. Direct to Andy, and then we're just going southwest all the way to Van Coof. Van Uh Let's get our arrival chart up here and pin you. Make sure our <coughs> see booth transition. Let's go back booth, and then. Fitev need to be uh, what's the below? Is it um, backslash FL two one zero B? I think. Yes, cool. Yeah, we need to be below twenty one thousand. And then lane. Is lane on here? <coughs> Uh, 
Oh, this is for... This is for 8 left and right and 1, 3. Okay. So there's no... Oh man, I need two six left. Cause we don't want to taxi that far. I right, lost two six left. Um, let's see, what are the approaches? Let's get this. Let's pin this chart. What are the stars for? Ah, uh, it's this one. So pin you and unpin the first one. There we go. Uh, so we don't need that uh, restriction in there. How do I clear it? I don't know how to clear a low 210. All right, let's go. We'll worry about it later. Between 12 and 9, 9 on the speed, that's in there. Go pad above 9, above 7, above 5. Saved, above 3. And then I think that goes into the approach. Yeah, saved. What is that? VRNB? Where are you at? It's not VR. Hmm. Need to be at 1390. So we're missing a. Let's put that one in there. N O X O B. Execute, move you up, and we need to be at 3,000 there. So at 3,000. Huh. I know there was a uh, air rack update uh, on Simbrief and Navgraph. So just a heads up for you guys if you haven't updated yet. Maybe that was missed on the update, but... Okay, cool. Should be good to go. So, let's check out our route one more time. Legs page. We'll skip all the way through. Boom, boom, boom. All the way down. Straight in. Beautiful. Let's go back to map. Uh, map. Hello. Map. And zoom back in. Cool, route's good. Let's go init ref button. Our cost index today is going to be sync out. 3.7 on reserve, zero fuel weight, 104.1. Boom, we're going to cruise at 36,000 feet today. Execute that in one limit. We will not derate since we only have 5,000 feet runway. Super short. Laps five for takeoff, CG, 23.7, V-speeds, Ruby. Uh, trim's going to be four and a half. That looks good. And let's set our cruise speed up here. Let's go 0 0.80 and execute that. Should do its calculations. Cool beans. Let's go descent. We're going to do 300 knots. On the descent into Vancouver, 250 knots under 10,000. Cool beans. Let's go up top. Let's get the yaw damper window heats both on and set. All fuel pumps can go on. RTO, set you. And I'm sure he's done fueling. Let's see here. Yes, release and reset the fuel flow. 
beautiful. <clears throat> Let's get the takeoff page up here again. Takeoff speed at 132. That in the box. Runway heading is going to be 266. Boom. Uh, no SID, so we'll just go. We'll just set our cruise for departure. 360. And let's set our landing elevation 7. So we'll leave that at 0 and then set our cruise on the uh, pressurization panel. Beautiful. What else? Uh, passengers are here. Let us board, shall we? Oops. So I'm going to go menu, FS actions, ground services, uh, potable water guy can go, and we'll let in the VIPs through the gate. Literally, drive right through the gate. Cool, they are rolling in and ramping the gate. Got the hydraulics. Noise hitting them switches. All right, thanks, pot of water, dude. And let's go. Uh, 28 packs on board, get them boarded. And 2,100 pounds of cargo, so we'll go 1050 in the front and 1050 in the back. Those all loaded everything on board we will get out of here let's do it yes 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 indeed <clears throat> oh yeah we did start this stream a little late today uh, I had to push it back had some stuff going on uh, but glad I didn't have to move it completely so it happens cool um, got half the passengers on board let's get the we'll let the maintenance guy go thanks Holmes Uh -oh. Looks like there's an event in Jacksonville. Why is there a stoplight at this airport? That's so funny. It's so small. I wonder if that's. They really have that in real life. We'll get our camera set up for N. Jones Stark. Cool. Cargo's all on board. And how's our crew looking? Cool. Everybody's on board. Let's release the SUVs. Later, dudes. It's been real. We'll get our camera set up for our start. Let's go doors, air stairs door closed and we're going to need to get rid of the chalks too cool beans alright let's start this bad boy and wheels up shall we uh, I think he's at the Edmonton uh, International Airport. Super quiet. I can barely hear him. Let's see, my audio's all the way down, so I'll turn that up a bit for later. Um, what else? Let's get this bad boy started. Everything looks good. Let's get the. Whoops. Let's get the beacon on and packs off for engine start. Set the right ignition, and we'll set number two to ground and get it rolling. The prog page on the 
first officer's side and leg page on our side. Cool. So we're waiting for 25%. All the pressure's alive and one is alive. There is 25. Let's listen to her startup. Engine number two, it's good. We'll set number one to ground. And same deal. In two's rolling, all pressure's rolling, in one's rolling. We'll intro the fuel, 25% on the in two. Twenty-four, twenty-five. There she goes. Two good engines. Start switches off. Let's go up top. Let's get the Jennies on. Gen one, Gen two. APU can go off. Start switches continuous. One and two. And probe heats up top. Both on. Packs back to auto. ISO valve set to auto. APU bleed can go off. Get the Gen one on up top and flaps five take off set come in let's go engine system buttons let's do a flight control check up down lefty righty right rudder left rudder coop let's get our tara on beautiful and altimeter is already set Let's go flight directors on, auto throttle armed. I don't think there's any hills or mountains in the area. We'll hit the terrain. I don't think there's anything. I think it's pretty flat over here. So we don't need terrain for today. Let's arm VNAV. And we'll arm LNAV once we get airborne. Let's go let's reset our camera. We'll go taxi lights. Uh, parking brake can go off. We're going to taxi Bravo to 2 6. Um, we're the only bird at this airport. You've got some traffic in Edmonton at the uh, International Airport. So we'll be good. Let's do it. Let's roll. We are going. Let's go. These taxiways are tiny, too. So, this will be interesting. Very, very skinny taxiways. <clears throat> well, we're like barely rolling. Let's get some thrust here. Cool. Let's do it. K 
Canada, what up? Let's go, let's go. <clears throat> Cool, so that traffic's, they're south of us, so I think we should be fine. Yeah, shouldn't be a factor. Forest. Scenery's getting bouncy. I wonder if it's not loading in right. I thought this one uh, was Sim Update 10 compatible. It's like we're off roading right now. <laughs> and the rocks. Rocky Mountains. Uh oh, there's a bump. Oh, well, wasn't that bad. That's a bunch of Cessnas. It's flight school or something. Cool. Alright, so we're going to park straight out and then make a left turn headed southwest to Vancouver. It's <laughs> so bumpy. I don't know if it's supposed to be this bumpy. Uh, let's do a quick traffic check. Before we roll out here. Yeah. They shouldn't be any factor. We're pretty far north. So we should be good. Alright, let's do it. Alright, let's go... Landing lights, strobes, all on. We're the only bird anywhere near this airport, so we should be good to go. And we'll go ahead and hit the clock. Started. Let's go to Vancouver, shall we? Let's get on the center line here. And we're going to spool them up first before we let's hold the brakes. Let's spool them up to 40 ish percent. And there's 40. Let's go toga. And throttle set. Let's go. Airspeed's alive. Check. 80 knots. Double check. V1. Let's rotate as we're running out of runway. Nice. Positive rate of climb. Gears coming up. Double tap the brakes. Start our left turn. Pretty quick here. Let's arm L nav. Hard left. Let's go. Could have used the sun visor actually. It's kind of bright. Looking right at the sun. Watch our angle here. Straighten her out. Oh, gusty. Let's get the nose down. Let's go flaps one. Climb power is slowly coming in. It's our runway off to our left. 
zoom my range out a little bit here. Let's go Command A. Go a little early. Nose is coming down. Let's go flaps clean. And up. Let's go, brownies. Let's do it. Let's go. Where's that visor? Got it. Might as well use it. Alright, we're picking up speed. <clears throat> and there's the nose coming up. Let's go gear off. After takeoff, checklist, RTO, go off. Let's go standard on the altimeter. And we're looking good. Sweet. 10,000 feet. Let's go lights off, start switches, both off. Where is that traffic headed in front of us? He looks like he's heading southwest ish, too. Cool. We are airborne on our way. wonder if we could see, I think that's downtown Edmonton. I think we were too far from the, uh, the two updates from World Update 11. It was, uh, the, f the stadium and the arena. They were more downtown. Off to our left. Off to our wing. Wing lip. Later, Edmonton. So yeah, we took off from uh, Villanueva Airport in northwest Edmonton. Heading down to Vancouver. Sweet. On our way. Should be a pretty approach. Hence of Vancouver. Kind of like we had in a uh, nice scenic approach into Quebec City on Tuesday's live stream. And we had a sunset landing as well. That was pretty sweet. So, yes. Cool beans. Let's jump back up front real quick. We're at about 19,000 feet, going up to 360, and we are cruising. Cool. Sweet. On our way. Let me see. Let's go in the back. Those two updates I mentioned were. So we were. We took off way up here, Villanueva. Where's the little airport? Yeah, right here, Villanueva Airport. And World Update 11, Commonwealth Stadium, downtown, and Rogers Place Arena, downtown as well. So these were both added uh, from World Update 11. We got some other stuff on our way to Columbia Icefield Skywalk, at the Fairmont Chateau Hotel, and... 
It's another Fairmont Hotel. It's interesting. I wonder why they picked hotels. CYCG Airport. This was a new... Oh, yeah, this is one of the five uh, new airports. So we're going to be coming like this. Southwest. Hell's Gate Air Tram. Cool. That was added. World Update 11. Canada. Alexandra Bridge. Provincial Park. And Cloud Raker Sky Bridge. Cool. And then there's a bunch of stuff in uh, in Vancouver. Two bridges. Alex Fraser Bridge. Lionsgate Bridge. Playground of the Gods. Whatever that is, I'm not too sure. And here's uh, Vancouver International. We'll be flying in. So we'll probably see... Because 26 left is here. Which will probably fly right over this Alex Fraser Bridge. And we might be able to see this Playground of the Gods thing, too. So, yeah. And then, what else? The Burrard Street Bridge. That was added. And then the Conservatory. All in Vancouver. World Update 11. And there was some other stuff as well. On the Victoria like Island over here. Fort Rod Hill, Lighthouse, Legislative Assembly of BC, Castle. Wonder where their airport is. So, yeah, some other stuff from World Update 11. Uh, Canada, this black line here is like the Canada US border. So, pretty cool stuff. So yeah, some quick highlights. World update 11. Canada style. Cool, we got 15 miles till uh, top of climb. Let me jump back up front real quick. At 32,000 feet and slowly losing airspeed, but it's all good. Go ahead and start some jams. Why not? Why not? Why? I still don't understand why the sun through the visor does not show the sun rays only on the outside of the plane. So silly. I don't get it. Uh, what should we stop with? Oh, let's see here. Uh, let's go with this one. Seascape. Cool. Alright, alright, alright. Bum, 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 bum. Cool. Back in the BBJ. Loving it. Sweet. Let's do our scenery and livery. Uh, we are flying today. So we took off from CV. What? CZBL. Edmonton. Uh, Villanueva, if I'm pronouncing that right, probably not. Uh, so this is where we just took off from. Uh, freeware on flightsim.to. If you guys want to pick this one up, courtesy of Digidriver. 
So small, pretty small airport. Longest runway is 5,000 feet. But it's got a lot of ground uh, detail on it. Bunch of GA, GA birds at the tower. Built in there. Yeah, we took off runway, was it 2-1? This way. This is the shorter runway. Some nice night lighting. Airplane in the grass. Don't know what that's supposed to resemble. Cool. Now we're back at the top. <clears throat> yeah, so, uh... Yeah, it's pretty small file size. It, oh, it's not Sim Update 10 compatible technically, but didn't have too many. Um, didn't have any issues really. Just taxiway was kind of bumpy. But uh, yeah, this is a the freeway we're rocking today, and we're just doing um, the default. Uh, Vancouver for the arrival. Yeah, I was thinking Microsoft did Vancouver as like a default airport, but no, they did Seattle, Friday Harbor, but not Vancouver. So that is our freeware for today. No freeware for um, Vancouver. I know there's a payware. I just don't fly to Vancouver hardly ever. So, where is the livery you're rocking today? It's probably farther back uh, where is it it's not on here maybe next page where you at where you at show yourself there it is and then this is the let's go off side for this one Get the camera back so it doesn't crush the eardrums. I'm on the wrong side too. Move it over here. Oh, there's our traffic in front of us. Courtesy of Anarud. Nice white and purple livery. Three purple stripes down the middle. And on the winglets, the BBJ. Nice, simple, uh, clean livery. G nuts. <laughs> the hair stairs. Sweet. Yep, that's pretty much it. Nice little livery. I haven't used the air cart or the cart stairs in a while. I kind of just like using the air stairs animation. So, this one's uh, freeware on flightsim.to as well. Um, I don't think. Oh, it is a PTP. 
So he can install it with the. Uh, looks like he's got a bunch of uh, airline liveries: United, Southwest, Scandinavian. So yeah. And then I just downloaded this one. Or here, let's just go to liveries. It was just released. This BBJ November 9 pop up box. Just downloaded this one, so we'll be flying this uh, pretty sweet livery white, blue, and gray. We'll be flying this one soon. Very nice. BBJ style. Love it. I think this was a. I'm not sure if this one's a PTP or not. I think it was. I believe so. So yeah, another new release. If you guys want to check it out, uh, brownies. It's funny you ask that. I um. I actually there's on flights MTO the website where I get like the different paint and livery um, and sceneries. Oh, it's getting rocky. Um, I suggested that. Um, Drake's Blue Plane. But nobody's made it yet. So. If, uh, if a developer made it, I would fly it, but nobody's made it yet. Um, let's see. But nobody's nobody's made that uh, that livery just yet, fortunately. Uh, let's see. It is this one. You guys haven't seen it. I'm trying to find a good picture of it. Um, this one. It's light blue with the clouds on it. Air Drake on the engines and then this owl logo on the tail. There are other pictures? Yeah. There's another good shot of it. 767. So he went big dog status. It's like double the plane of the 737-700. Big bird. Air Canada. That was spotted in Canada. It was a good shot. Looks like it's taken off. Hey, what's going on, IADPS? Thanks for hopping in the stream and chat. Hello. How are you? Thanks for stopping by, hanging out with us. Happy Thursday. We are flying some Canada Ops today. Edmonton to Vancouver, Canada. Flying through some of the uh, World Update 11 updates so it's a pretty sweet livery it's just yeah just need somebody to make it I don't know how to make liveries yet Brammies unfortunately unfortunately bum, 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 bum. Oh, shoot. Uh, I didn't want to do that. There's another really good... Nice shot of it. Cargo jet. I don't know what the belly says. Let's 
Let's see what the belly says. Um, what does it say? If you're reading this, something. Like one of his albums. It says something on the belly. Come on. Oh, if you're reading this, we left. <laughs> it's got clouds under the engines, too. Drake has too much money. Too much money to... <laughs> put all this nonsense on an airplane. Let alone a 767. Beast of an airplane. It's so funny. If you're reading this, we left. <laughs> Never realized that's what it said on the belly, or even had writing on the belly. Ah, oh, here it is. There we go. Uh, uh, uh. If you're reading this, we left. <laughs> All right. It's hilarious. Hilarious. What did it say? Can you see it, Brownies? Is it too small? It says, if you're reading this, we left. <laughs> that is too funny. That is funny stuff. Funny, funny, funny. Actually, let's go to Belly Cam. Check out these snow caps. Beautiful. Where are we at? What's this say? Kin Basket Lake. Abraham Lake behind us. All kinds of mountains out here. Beautiful. <laughs> yeah, Brownie's good one, yeah. Drake's got too much money just casually paint that on the belly like oh yeah by the way can you guys uh, paint this random saying on the belly why not why not let's watch the um, world update 11 uh, preview video too <clears throat> Because I was able to find it um, after Xbox had put out the. Is it this one? Make sure the sound is off so we don't get any copyrights. Come on, ads. Really? comes a lake up here. Uh, brownies, we are flying over. Whoops. This looks like it says Kin Basket Lake. That goes into Columbia River right here. So this is Columbia River. And then we're coming up on Revelstoke Lake as well. I think that's ahead of us, though. Yeah, this is uh, right here is the Columbia River. And then let's run World Update 11 Canada. Uh highlight trailer preview video I still haven't loaded into this airport the first one that looks like it's right off of a lake 
It's got... I, you know what? I, no, I think I loaded into this airport. But this yellow building didn't load in. And I have buildings on... Ultra. So, I don't know what I'm missing. Newfoundland. That looks super pretty, too. The whole Newfoundland Island. And Far East Canada. Nova Scotia. Halifax. New Brunswick. Quebec. We flew into Quebec City on... Uh, Tuesday. Montreal. We're flying to Montreal on Sunday. Toronto Pearson, which this isn't even Toronto Pearson. Niagara Falls, we flew there on Tuesday as well. We flew from there. So this says Toronto Pearson International Airport. This is Toronto City Bishop Airport. <laughs> because it's right on the lake. That is not Toronto International. Toronto's like this way north. I messed up on that one. Toronto. I wonder if we can see it from here. Yeah, so there's... Toronto City Bishop Airport and Toronto International is like way over here. Ontario Spirit Catcher Island Winnipeg Saskatchewan Saskatoon This is a funny name research station. There's no airport over there. Or no, there was, but there's no scenery for it. Destruction Bay. Yukon. National Park. Edmonton, this is where we just kind of took off from, so this was too far downtown for us from the airport we took off from, but this was one of um, the updates I had mentioned, the Rogers Place Arena. Where'd the stadium go? Oh, I missed it. And then this was the other one, the Commonwealth Stadium. This was also downtown uh, Edmonton. Pretty sweet uh, stadium, yeah. And then downtown Edmonton, buildings look amazing. Some bridges. Looks pretty sweet. Nice. One of the hotels, two of the hotels. Skywalk, mentioned that earlier too. Vancouver, where we'll be flying in here shortly on our way into Vancouver. And I think that's it. Nice. Sky is always calling. Let's see, actually go back here. Let's go to our sim map. Boom, 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 boom. Where are we now? We are... Revelstoke? Where is Revelstoke? Right here. So... Trying to think what we saw in the video. More so will be a lot of the Vancouver stuff that we'll probably see here soon. 
Let's watch it one more time, shall we? Boom, 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 boom. Oh, still on pause. Nice. This is like way Arctic North Canada too. Newfoundland, that's east, far east Canada. So many updates to Canada. Quebec. Nice. Sweet. Ontario. Toronto. Spirit Catcher. Day 11. And if you guys are enjoying today's stream and want to show your support to the channel, as always, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. Uh, would mean the world to me. And it's a huge help to the channel. I always love sharing my flight sim experience with you all. And all the updates and new things we get along the way. It's always exciting to share and check out with you guys. And got plenty more awesome streams, trips coming up. And I will let you guys know what we are flying next week. We'll have a different theme next week. And I think after next week, we'll probably come back and do some more uh, Canada Canada trips. I think that'll be that'll be a plan. Uh, and I do live stream weekly and exclusively here on Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. Um, so if you hit the notification bell, you will not miss a beat. Uh, you'll be notified for all of our future streams and videos and all that good stuff. Um, and our weekly stream schedule is Tuesday, thir Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Sundays. Uh, Pacific Standard Time, typically in the afternoons. Uh, so looking forward to having you guys join us fly with us, hang with us, stop by, say hello, and chat. Uh, always love hearing from new folks and having you on board. Let's jump back in the cabin. Let's roll through. Why not? Bum, bum, bum. I wish you could like there's got to be some way you can use the the drone cam in the cabin, but I haven't figured it out. It's like too too shaky. We got one of the labs here. Bum, bum. This really should be a bedroom back here. That's how most of the BBJs are equipped and set up. You got the bedroom, the shower, all that jazz in the far back. <clears throat> Instead of these regular, you know, commercial seats. Bum, 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 bum. It's been a while since we 
did a little cabin tour at the conference table ish whatever you want to call it <clears throat> oh yeah brownies Canada is huge we just pop up the like world map like Canada is huge this line here is kind of the separator between Alaska and Canada oh yeah yep bigger than the US for sure like look at all this like this is us down here like this much but then this is all Canada and it keeps going up actually not sure how far up for like this is Greenland over here but I want to say like all this right here is Canada up here and then you got all this I think this dotted line is the separator like it's crazy yeah cuz I want to come back there's the research station that was in the, that preview video yeah super crazy it's huge massive just zoom out and it's like huge Newfoundland over here and this island this Canada as well super pretty lots of updates over here too uh, from sim update 11 or world update 11 Canada all this stuff they added a bunch a bunch of stuff all these red camera icons like look at all this tons of updates and world update 11 all these red cameras tons of stuff that's what makes me want to come back and do some more Canada ops so we could see more of it versus just one week of it only seen a few things. Shower, lab. And you got the front. Cool. Hang in the back with you guys. We got, let's see, 90 miles to our top of descent. So. There's no. There's no uh, ATC on anymore for Vancouver, so I think I'm gonna do a quick, uh, quick restroom break. Actually, let's go back here. Let's go. Whoops. sit on this side. Uh, I'm going to take a quick restroom break before we plan our approach and start our descent and I will be right back guys. BRB.
All right, we are back. My microphone working here. All right, sixty-seven. Oops, I want to go back up front. Probably on this side. Let's go back up front. Uh, we'll get you out of the way for now. Bum, bum, bum. Let's get our airport button on here. All right. So we got 63 miles till top of drop. We are probably still going to plan for what was it, two six left. Let's grab the Metar. Because Sim Toolkit Pro, I don't know how often it refreshes. CYVR. Winds are 290 at 9, so still from the west. Uh, temperature's 18, 30, 11 on the altimeter. 30, 11. Altimeter is set. And we are still good to go on 26 left approach. Let's set our bottom altitude, glide slope 1390, so we'll set it to 1400. VNAV will take us down. Fourteen hundo. Boom. We can bug our heading to 16. Cool. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Cool. So, what else do we need to plan here? Let's go down to NRF. We're going to do flaps 40 landing. Uh, ILS, we're going to tune 1107. 1, 10, 7, both sides, 1, 10, 7, and final course is 263, set that in here, 2, 6, 3, both sides, 2, 6, 3, Minimums. Oh. Uh, is this A, B, C, D? I had a. I need to figure out how to read these charts. And I think we're C. 207? Well, let's do 207. So let's get that bugged in here. 207. One more. There we go. 207. Good to go. Uh, let's see. Minimums are good. Let's do our runway fix. We are going runway. Two six left. Uh, let's do a ten mile approach ring and five mile approach ring. And let's go plan mode. Make sure they actually show up. Legs step. Q 
Keep going. There they are. Cool. Cool, they're in there. And we're just going to leave this 210 below uh, altitude restriction. I don't know how to remove it. If you guys know, let me know. I put this in earlier, but we don't necessarily need it, but we'll leave it in there. Alright, let's go back to map. Zoom you back out. 40. Range. Uh, what else we got? We set our bottom altitude already. 1400. Wide slope. It's negative 28 Celsius. Holy moly. How cold is it in Vancouver? 19? So it's not too cold there. There's uh, our approach here. We don't have the hold in there, is it? No. camera quit let's do the overlay oh, we're still kind of a ways out Nicola Lake just past that let's go outside for a minute In. these mountains. Nothing like good old mountains. Sweet. Cockpit disappeared. <laughs> there it is. Got a turn coming in. Oh, we're all the way zoomed in. Sweet. All right, guys. We got three miles till we start descending. So we should start to hear the engines cool down here pretty quick. If you guys are just joining, stopping by, thanks for hanging out with us, jumping in the stream chat. Say hello if you are new or watching live. I always love hearing from you folks. And if you're enjoying the video, please hit the like and subscribe button. We will have plenty more live streams coming up. And actually this week, uh, after today, we'll have our third leg of the week on Sunday. Uh, we'll be flying from, if I remember correctly, uh, Montreal. No, we're flying to Montreal. Uh, we're flying from Newfoundland uh, Island, 
uh, far east Canada uh, over to Montreal. So that is the plan for Sunday. Uh, and that stream will be 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time on Sunday. So if you guys do hit the notification bell, uh, you guys will be notified um, and won't miss any new uploads or streams. And again, thanks for stopping by as always. Happy to have you on board. And flying with us today. As we fly in style in the old, good old BBJ, PMDG BBJ 737-700, the little stubby guy. I hope somebody could develop a new interior, that would be sweet. That is a wish list of mine. That would be so cool. Definitely, definitely love that. Bum, 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 bum. Cool. Starting our descent here into beautiful Vancouver International. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, I have the wrong. Oh, that's the overlay. Okay. Never mind. So we have to go with this one. Which, can I change this? Change? Uh, let's see. Huh. Nope. It's all good. So, should be a nice approach. Looks like we'll go over the river twice on the approach into Vancouver. It's too bad the winds weren't the other way. We can come in from the water side, that would be sweet. Those are always my favorite. Bum, 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 bum. So we'll leave our approach chart up here. So we send into Vancouver. Let's see how many other birds we have in the area before we hop back up front. Is there anybody out here? I thought there was a few departures scheduled. On Vatastic, maybe not. It's just taking a while to reload. Alright, all good. Let's jump back up front. Make sure we're on pace here. Let's get our terrain radar on. Got some nice size mountains coming up. And we're at 21,000 feet. Let's the standard 3011 for the altimeter and two uh, Vancouver. Cool. Looks like we're on 10 knots over speed. Let's slow her down. Let's load our replay software, flight recorder. Bum, bum, bum. All the snow caps out here. Sweet. Oh, there we go. Should have plenty of runway today, so we probably won't need too much auto brake. Yeah, 
almost 11,000 foot runway. Cool. We are below 21,000. Cool. Let's zoom our range in here. So we'll go auto break one. I'd rather use manual break, honestly, anyway. Set our speed break set. Let's go with the belly cam. It's a valley right here, it's pretty sweet. Nice. That is awesome. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, in Sunday's stream, I want to try to not forget. Uh, we can go through, like, we can just kind of pick everything that's on the World Update 11 map. Uh, this one that I sent in the chat on Tuesday's stream. We can go through all of each individual, click through each of these. All the red ones are from World Update 11 Canada edition. All these, we can click through everything. And the airports are brown. So we can go through all of these on Sunday stream because it will be a little bit longer. Um, so don't let me forget on Sunday that we can click through everything, see everything, all that good stuff. This is sweet. Looks so good. It's kind of slowly loading in, but... Sweet. Love the low, like, smog-looking clouds. So cool. This looks like a lake up here. Awesome. Beautiful. Oh, I didn't realize you could see the engine from here. Alright, let's jump back up front. Where are we at? Oh, we need a slow to 230 already? Ah, we do. Alright, let's get the speed brakes out. I totally forgot about that con speed constraint. <clears throat> Alright, we're about 37 miles to the runway. So there's only two arrivals, assuming we're the first. So not much traffic out here. Which is all good. Alright. Maybe above 9,000. 230 on the speed. We're at 230. Reset our speed brake. Boom. Let's see if we can get some Vancouver views here. a little ways out. <clears throat> Alright, we're at 10,000 feet. We go landing lights, runway lights on, start switches continuous, both engines good to go. Uh, let's see, I'm just going to set our runway heading 263. Set it a little early. <clears throat> bum, 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 bum. 
I'm gonna do a call out. Let's go ahead and pause the jams. <clears throat> Run 22.8. Make sure, yes, cool. And Vancouver traffic, number 5 to Alpha, 25 miles to the northeast inbound. Connect 5 arrival, runway 26 left. Uh, Vancouver traffic. Cool. Need to not forget to do our call outs. Cool. Descending through 8,500 for. Above five thousand. <clears throat> I just hope VNAV doesn't act silly. Vancouver. There's an airport right here. This is gorge. Gorgy. Beautiful. Sweet approach. All right, how are we looking? Let's go 10 mile range. And we've got about 8 miles. So we take, take a right. And that'll be our final approach. Looks like some buildings are starting to load in. It almost reminds me of Hawaii. I've only flown in Hawaii a couple times in the sim, but there's one of those bridges that we talked about earlier. World Update 11. Sweet. All right, we got to be above 3,000. That's saved, and then down to 3,000. <clears> Let's get our approach plate up here. Cool. There's some buildings. It's kind of even better view. Vancouver. What is up? I agree, brownies. Very cool indeed. Very cool, very swag. I love it. All right. Straighten out here. Let's go ahead and hit record. Uh, replay. And let's go flaps one. Coming in. And we need some speed brake kind of coming in hot here. And Vancouver traffic, November 5, to Alpha, 10 mile final runway 26 left, make. Cool, let's go flaps 5, 10 miles out. They are coming in hot. Yeah, I started the replay early. Uh, so we can, we'll be able to run it back. See, do I really need the visor? 
Uh, yeah, kind of. <laughs> kind of, sort of. Uh, we're eight miles out, still fast. Let's go gear down. Laps 15. What else was I going to do? We're getting something. Oh, let's arm the approach. Doi. Approach is armed, there we go. Should take us down to the runway, glide slope, localizer. Yeah, as bad as I want to go outside with the camera views, I'd hate for us to get a CTD. It crash on us, so we will we'll run some replays after this. Let's rearm our speed brakes. Beautiful. Yeah, the sun visor helps. Crazy, I can't even see the runway. And this actually colors the runway in. Would have never thought. Let's go VREF speed 125. On the box, four mile final, let's go flaps full. And Vancouver traffic, November 5th, get off, uh, three mile final, two six left, Vancouver. Don't think there's any traffic in front of us. Should be groovy. Alright, let's pull the throttles back to match in one. Let's go, my bird. And my throttles. Throttle throttles off. Oh. One thousand. Yeah, the sun visors are amazing. Game changer. Watch our speed. Get the nose up a little bit. <clears throat> oh, we're gonna go right over the river. That's sweet. Come on, frames, don't fail me now. It's getting a little stuttery. And we're going to be parking right off to the left, too, so... be parking right on the river. Alright, let's get some butter going here. Oh. A little high. Look good. Two whites, two reds. We're grooving. Right over the river. Let's hit the nose up. Minimums. Minimums. Continue. Forget to flare. There we go. Nice and easy. There she goes. Nose down. Nice and easy. Versers are rolling. And let's go manual brakes. There we go. 50 knots. Hit the clock. And we can get off here to the left. Beautiful. Nice. Good stuff. Welcome to Vancouver, guys. Canada. Auto throttle button. Auto brakes. Let's go flaps up. Speed brakes in. And we're going to take a left here on Alpha. Uh, Vancouver traffic. 5 to Alpha clear, runway 26 left. Vancouver. Oh, let's go landing lights. Strobes off. Negative 154 on the landing. I will take it. And let's zoom you in. I'm going to make a right up here, curve to the right, and then 
I think this is all the GA stuff here, so. Sweet. Let's do one engine taxi. We'll just use number one. Uh, and then we'll come back and run some replays. Power 12 minutes on the clock. Beautiful. Oh, and I did notice too. Uh, I don't know if it was Sim Update 10, but the marshallers are finally back on the ramp. I was wondering why I hadn't seen any uh, ramp uh, peeps. Because we used to get them. And I wonder if anybody will be out here today. Don't know. Doesn't look like it. Let's park over here, I guess. Let's see. Let's just taxi down Alpha. Maybe we'll get, we'll see some uh, ramp crew. Vancouver. What is up? Uh, kind of loading in. Slowly but surely. Let's see, let's just park over here. We'll face the water. Why not? Cool, so we'll uh we'll park here on the ramp. Leave the bird running, run some replays, come back, button her up, and we'll sign on out of here. Go back to the called the private ramp back here. Why not? This is pretty sweet back here. Any ground crew? Alright, it's all good. We'll go right here next to this uh, this hangar here. Let's go taxi light off. And we'll park her right here. This will be good. And hit the brakes. Cool. Set the parking brake. Sweet. Stop the recording. Let's disconnect VATSIM and the pilots so we don't mess anybody else up on the network. Um, let's see. We will finish our flight here. Uh, we don't need Navigraph. Close you out. And finish flight. I'm just going to mark this stream. Save you. Beautiful. Negative 154 on the landing. I'll take it. Landing report. Uh, right on the marker. Right on the money. Sweet. Cool. I'll take it. Quit Sim Toolkit Pro. Uh, what else do we need? Need the, uh, some iTunes action. Some jams for the replay. Reset you. And we'll run this view first on the replay. Get the controller out. And replay, go. 
the tip flaps full. You can come in. Scenery's slowly rolling. jams yeah this was one of those bridges uh, from world update 11 Canada is the sound like the sound lit no it's where it should be huh why it sounds extra Noisy. So it's a pretty sweet approach into Vancouver. Sweet. With all the highways downtown buildings and flaps 40 takes forever to load in yeah let's stay on the right side of the bird left side's not bad either got the river Is it still loading the flaps? There we go. Like, <laughs> jeez. Sweet. It's all the downtown buildings. Looks like maybe this is downtown Vancouver over here actually. Yes, looks like there's some cruise ships over there too. Oh, I can't see it from here. But yeah, it's a bunch of buildings over here. I think this is actually this has got to be downtown Vancouver, I would assume. Yeah, this was a straight-in approach, too. Nice, nice and easy approach into Vancouver. That'll do. I'll take it. Didn't see the... What was it? Play, playgrounds of the Gods? Did not see that. I think we were too far from it. <laughs> oh man, that smoky things coming from the engine now. This approach was longer than I thought it was. There's that bridge again. Now let's go from the back. We usually sit up front. Let's do this view. Right over the river. What a sweet approach. Beautiful. Let's go over the highway. Nice. Winds were pretty calm. Nice and easy. Some butter. Ah, oh, we I think Sims will get pros off. <laughs> we did not touch down right on the markers. It's right after. Nice. Sweet. 
sweet. The terminal off to the right side. Oops, going the wrong way. Yeah, the terminal's over there. Sweet. I right, see so the file cam. Let's reset you. Zoom it in so it's not so loud. All right, let's go pause. Rewind. Back it up a little bit more. Speed breaks down. Water in the background. Nice. Sweet. Got the terminal in the middle of the uh, airport. Awesome approach. Love it. Nice and easy. Yeah, we touched down right after the markers. Sweet. Beautiful Vancouver. British Columbia. There's the terminal there. Sweet. Terminals right in the middle. Yeah, it's nice that Microsoft redid the weather to get more more cloud effects. So that's nice. All right, what's next? Let's do a let's do a gear cam landing. That'll be pretty. Airspeed alive. Airspeed is alive. Resume. Yeah. Brownie's favorite. Let's do it. The highway. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Nice. We got 99 views. On today's stream, what? We need one more crack a hundo. We need one more view to hit 100. Hurry, guys. Share, share the stream. Hurry, hurry. Everybody you know. Hurry, hurry, hurry. <laughs> Just kidding. Can we crack a 100? At 99 views, one more. All we need is one. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom. Nice. There we go. Cracked 100. Appreciate you guys. You guys are the best. And while we're at it, smash that like and subscribe buttons we will be back Sunday uh, for our third leg this week live stream on Sunday at 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time we'll be doing some more Canada World Update 11 uh, ops here at Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 
So some more butter on Sunday. Nice. Almost forgot to flare. Flared in the nick of time. Hit the brakes, hit the brakes. Skirt. Skirt, skirt. Almost thought we were going to taxi onto a different runway. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum. Alright, let's do our flyover camera. And then we will s sign off. Uh, so we need to go back to, let's reset you. And I'll need this to pop out. A different window. And let's go reset. Actually, let's reset on the turn. Oh, too fast. Cool. Let's set up our camera. It's like the sun's getting ready to go down. I did, uh, I did pull the time back an hour, just so it wasn't pitch black uh, in Vancouver when we get here, or when we got here. Because Tuesday stream we were. It was uh, got pretty late on us, which isn't the worst thing that could happen, but it does get a little too too dark. All right, let's go. Zoom me back out. Let's go. Pause. Reverse. 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 And we'll let her fly in. Whoa, too fast. Curious. That's close enough. Put the speed brakes down. Diego Santos, hey, what's going on? Good to see ya. Brazil, what is up? Thanks for stopping by. Hopping in the stream of chat. Happy Thursday. Thank you, thank you for stopping by. Hope you are doing well. And enjoying the approach. Our replay approach into Vancouver, Canada. Bring her in. No tire. Oh, there we did. Did it on the nose gear. No tire smoke on the main gear. Bum, 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 bum. Nice. Love it. Cool. All right, we'll let. Uh, let's go reset. We will let the replay take us in to the ramp. And jump back in the bird here. Let's get the flaps up. Speed brakes in. Brakes are hot from the replay. It's all good. Uh, let's do our after landing checklist. Let's go. Start switches can go off. Probe heats up top can go off. 
and we can start the APU. Cool. APU is starting. And we will let's get some aerial views. Uh, Vancouver here. Then we got the water off to our left. Back here. Just off the end of the runway. And then the terminal. Behind us. Some sweet mountains in the back. Wonder if there'll be any ground crew now that we've loaded a couple times or landed a couple times. Got the river right off the ramp here too. It's pretty sweet. Should have just parked back here. <laughs> I was hoping for some ground crew. But yeah, it's pretty sweet. The river's right here. All right, let's hop back in. APU gins are ready. Let's go gin one. And Gen 2. And we go AP bleed on. We'll set that on early. Cool. Gonna enjoy the taxi here. Boom, boom, boom. That's the one nice thing about replay is switch the cameras check out the airport it's a taxi in don't have to worry about steering or self bam 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 stay in this camera here cool guys well, yeah, we'll let replay take us back to where we parked. Shut the bird down and uh, get the ground crew out here to help us unload. And then we will sign off. Button everything up, sign off, and get ready for our next stream Sunday. Sunday fun day. Park in here. Let's set our camera up. Why not? All right. Cool. Hey, few gins are good. Uh, parking brake set. Let's pause the jams for the shutdown. Let's go engine one and two. Beacon can go off. Get the chocks set and jams going again. Jump back inside. 
let's get the three fuel pumps off. We'll leave one on for the APU. And this thing has a bug. Number two, it's so annoying. Uh, let's go back up top. Yaw damper, window heats all off. Hydraulic pumps both off. ISO valve can go open. And let's get the crew out here. Uh, let's see. Maintenance, lav. And we'll get the air stairs door all open. Cool. Crew is rolling in. We'll do an aerial view of the crew. Sweet. Bum bum bum. It's my jam. All right. What else we need? Let's go return. Ground services. Let's go ahead and zero out passengers. Get them deplaned and their bags unloaded. Zero. Unload. And cool. Let's get the brakes cooled off. Oops, wrong button. Brakes are cooled. Sweet. We are unloading, deplaning, all that good stuff. Sweet. Alrighty, guys. That is going to wrap up today's stream and video. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this one. Uh, as much as I did seeing the some of the uh, World Update 11 Canada edition flying in Canada pretty much my first time flying in Canada really uh, so where we go we went uh, Edmonton Villanueva Airport uh, down to Vancouver uh, British Columbia Vancouver International Airport so sweet route saw a lot of mountains a lot of scenic scenic areas on the way here and then an awesome approach into uh, Vancouver so highly recommend this route if you guys want to fly this one uh, just want to thank everybody for flying with us today stopping by uh, appreciate each and every one of you guys joining hanging out with us flying with us saying hello in chat always happy to have you on board brownies IADPS and Diego Santos thank you thank you each of you guys for saying hello in chat and hanging out with us today appreciate you guys and everybody else if you're watching at a later date I appreciate you watching and hanging and uh, yeah if you guys enjoyed today's stream I want to show your support to the channel please hit the like and subscribe buttons uh, we greatly appreciate that and it is a huge huge help to the channel and I do live stream weekly and exclusively here on Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 on um, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Sundays. Uh, so if you guys hit the notification bell, you'll be notified for all of our future streams, videos, uploads, uh, won't miss a beat, all that good stuff. Um, I've also listed some of our favorite playlists um, of our past streams and flights. Uh, if you guys want to check them out, they are in the description below uh, of this video. Uh, so if you want to check out some other flights, other birds that we've flown, um, please do so. Would appreciate that support as always. Um, so yeah, we'll be back um, Sunday, uh, our third and final leg of the week at 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Uh, we'll be flying from uh, the Newfoundland uh, Island over to Montreal, so it should be a nice scenic water takeoff uh, departure out of uh, Newfoundland and then uh, over to Montreal, should be a nice city approach as well. Uh, looks like the passengers are all deported, so we'll let them be on their way. 
uh, again, thank you all for watching and hanging. Uh, appreciate each and every one of you guys for flying with us, hanging out with us, stopping by as always. Uh, we will see you guys in the next one on Sunday. Hope to see you guys there. 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Until then, hope everybody has a great weekend. Um, and we will catch you in the next video, guys. Later. See ya. Peace.